Yes, I'm this my Harry Bradshaw. So this is the sticker we're going to be using today, which is Word Off. Look at that one, Antonio. What it says. So I'm going to file the nail so it fits my cuticle better. I'm going to take a 150. It was so sad when Mr. Big died. Like Harry in the shower, shaking and crying. She's such a good actress, Mr. Jessica Parker, but she's a, I can't believe she's 54. She looks a lot older than 54. And her hands, oh my gosh. Why doesn't she have anything on her nails? And at least to put a little coat of gel on, or, you know, some shiny or something. Her hands look like she's 110 years old, you guys. She does not have the most beautiful hands for Mr. Jessica Parker. Gonna buff the cuticle area. These nails are so beautiful. I think I might do this shape on my mom next. She wants something shorter, but she doesn't get to pick. So I'm going to use Flash Gel 147 as a base, and then I'm going to put the sticker on top. And then on my ring finger, I'm going to use the Milky Pink Shiny as the base, and then use some of the Flash Gel stickers just to mix it up, because I feel like I haven't done an accent finger in a really long time. I'm not sure. Six feet away from Santa. What? It's gonna be a dark Santa. They're gonna be like, why does Santa look like he's Middle Eastern? Why is he so tan? Isn't he from the North Pole? I think like the OG Santa is German. Yeah, like the, 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 the story of Santa? I think he's Deutsch. Where is my clear? Oh. Where is my clear DIY doll? Here it is. Here she is. She can finally catch a live. Thanks for joining us today. Let's get our flashy lamp ready. Which ones? Oh, really? They work good? You're a fan. I hope that nail stays on because that peel off this card is no joke. Sneak around giving me chills. So where was Mr. St. Nick originally from? Was he Deutsch? Hold firmly in this. And then freeze. Santa Claus. I was watching this really funny video. I can't remember what it was. I think it was on YouTube. And they were talking about hospital, like the word hospital, how in various languages they all kind of made them sound the same on purpose, except in German. Like um, in Portuguese it's hospital, and in Spanish it's hospital, hospital, hospital in English. And then in German it's Krakenhaus. So as you guys know, I've been so busy here, and we're so lucky that we're almost all caught up with back orders right now, getting everybody out, getting ready for the new year, lots of new things for next year, like the 10XL, 
but this year I feel like we really killed it when it came to new product development and coming out with stuff. I feel like I need to do more videos. I feel like I need a clone. You know, we did the Live XL this year. We did Cooking Gel. We did the Shiny Star series. We did the Milky Shiny series. We did some new bits, like the new Russian Manicure Drill Bit set. We did the Drill Bit Container. We did the um, DIY gels. We did. Magic, magic syrup dropped this year. We dropped new acrylics like the easy white and the glitter ones and the sticker lines. So much stuff in 2021. Even though it's been a really interesting year in general, I'm so glad that I was able to spend it with you guys, people that I really love and admire and feel like are part of my family. I love this shape. She's so chic. So we're going to bake this for one minute now inside the Desling Darling Lamp. So was Nicholas the same as Santa Claus? Saint Nicholas? We have so many saints in the Catholic faith too. Even Mother Teresa's a saint. And when I was in the Netherlands, I heard another story also too, like about their kind of person like Santa Claus with the peats. Gotta love the Dutch. Big shout out to all my Dutch watchers. Do you guys like this jazzy music in the back? I feel like we're inside of a, like a really fancy department store or restaurant. Here she is, all nice and dry. Now I'm gonna get up inside the pile and just make sure the sides are nice and snatched. Why does this one open up all over the place? I think Gloria put this one here as a package must have left it and she's like, oh it's gonna lay them all there for that, so that way you can have more of a mat. So that's what I do. So here is our fantastic file. Let's make sure the sides are nice and straight. Did you guys get a lot of Christmas shopping done? I hope you have enocouture.com on your list, but you shouldn't wait for someone to give it to you. Give it to yourself, the best gift of all what I did. And then it's the end of the fiscal year, so you gotta spend, spend, spend. So that way you can put on your taxes. I'm not gonna make them super sharp. I want them kind of like more almondy, if you will. And if you have not used a fantastic file to file, you don't know what you're missing. It really changes the game. Why is it so different? And that is because the metal really makes a huge difference when it comes to making sharp lines, sharp, crisp lines when it comes to shaping the nail. I think for Christmas, I already got myself a whole bunch of Switch games. I have a PS5 too, but you guys know that. It arrived damaged, and then it took like two months to get it repaired by Sony, and this and that. So I do have a few games for PS5, but I have a lot of games for Switch, but I always go back to playing Pokemon, and I think for Christmas I got myself a whole bunch of more games, so that way I can write them off on my taxes. Always comes back to the bloody Pokemon game. Beautiful. So now I'm just going to buff off the top surface of the nail. So that way we can apply our color. Wherever you hit the nail with the file, make sure you hit it with a buffer so that way it's nice and smooth. The shape, she's everything. Hi, Miss Johnny Lane. Today I'm actually doing something different on my nails that I usually do. 
on my real nail, I always wear like pink press on gel or a pink number 13 or number one. But today I did just clear press on gel and I did the new milky pink shiny, which is what I have on my nail today. This is our new milky pink gel top coat. So it's shiny, but it's milky pink to go along with the milky shiny, which is so popular. We had a huge request to do a pink one actually, and I had thought about it too prior, so you guys are going to love it, especially if you like stuff that's really simple, really fast, and really natural, and really soft. It's everything. It's, it's so great too for like ombres, if your ombre is not super perfect, one coat of milky pink shiny or one coat of milky shiny, it's like a filter. So for the base color, we're going to use Flash Gel 147, but on this one, on my ring finger, we're going to use Milky Pink Shiny. So we're going to take Flash Gel in 147. It's always best to apply Flash Gels in thin coats versus one super thick one. So that way you can build up that color. when I put flash on, let me turn on the hard light so that way you, you can sparkle. Portugal, hello, thanks for joining us today, love. Don't forget, you guys, that promo code CHARM25 to save 25% off your sticker purchase this weekend only. So my mom thinks we should get a company car. And I was like, yeah, let's get a hammer. Just kidding. Look at that, so beautiful. This is Flash Show 147. Oops. No, I actually think a Mercedes-Benz minivan or a Mercedes-Benz van would be perfect as a company car. And the reason why is because I remember a long time ago I saw a car accident in South Korea. It wasn't fatal or anything, but I remember, I think it was like a Hyundai or a Kia, some Korean car brand, and it crashed into a Mercedes. And absolutely nothing happened to the Mercedes. And the other car looked like a stepped on cat. And they just always stuck with me. Oh my gosh, you guys, do you see why this color sold out so fast? It's just so stunning. a lot for a little 
little bit. And then on the pink one, we're going to do a coat of milk pink shiny, so that's where I think we're going to focus mine. I adore you, I adore you too, but you don't drive. That is correct, I do not know how to drive, but um, my brother works with me and my mom comes here too, so it would be used for that and also for picking up uh, orders or uh, merchandise, like when we have to go pick up boxes or shipping supplies and things like that too, so. Oh, you're welcome, Miss Priscilla. Look at that, isn't that lovely? So we're going to bake this for one whole minute. Actually 30 seconds because I'm going to do a really thin coat of shiny on top of the, of the stickers. So that way I can find mean, enough to see the flash off so that way I can put my shiny. What are you guys going to eat for Christmas? Let me know. Give me some inspiration, some ideas about what would be a good Christmas dinner. And please don't say tamales. Let's pass on the tamales for glory on Monday. What are you gonna eat for Christmas dinner? Tomorrow food from Lumpias. Mm -hmm. Oh, very like. So cool. I did not know that. Is Boston Market was it good? Maybe some vegetables. Nothing too crazy. So homegirl said that color, ham. I don't even drive either. We get driven. <laughs> We have private ooh, prime rib sounds pretty good. Priscilla says her husband's always tamales. No tamales. I'll go with tacos then. No turkey for us. Pozole. Beautiful roast beef with all the fixings. Prime rib sounds really good too. But that's some pulled pork. Do with him. 
No, they're here somewhere. I just saw them. I found them. I found them. I found them. Mm -hmm. Those are so cute. For a baby shower. I feel like it reminds me of that from Christmas too. Yeah. It reminds me of Toast. The brand Toast. Boston Market is overrated, but it's okay for roasted chicken. This year, we're in my life where I'm not having a full Italian spread. No mommy. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. That's right, Antonio Cabrino Wilson always has the Linguini clan. And actually, Italian food sounds really good for Christmas too. Look at that. Just like that, so pretty. Really? What is Dungeness Crab? That sounds scary. It sounds like a sounds like an a Zelda adventure. What? The Angry Crab Shack. Isn't that where like they make fun of you? What's the restaurant where they make fun of you? Let me know in the comments below if you guys know what I'm talking about, because not right now I'm sounding crazy. Christina, have you ever heard of a restaurant where they make fun of you? Yeah, like the waiters are like rude. It's supposed to be like a, a thing. The end. The end when it comes to nail products. Because enocouture.com is the best in the game. Hi from Dublin, Ireland. I love me a good Irish accent. No turkey, probably raw. Ooh, crispy pork belly. That sounds really good too. Bloody bear stickers. I can't remember. Nobody remembers the name of the restaurant where the servers are rude. Dick's Last Resort is what it's called. Last Resort. Dick's Last Resort. They're in different places of the country. I think more like in touristy areas. Really? Dick's Last Resort is what it's called. Quad stickers would look really cool with this one. Right here. Mm -hmm. They have one in San Antonio. Yeah, they're all over the place. That would be fun. I wonder where the nearest one is here in Arizona. We probably don't even have one because Arizona is so bad. Well, Tucson is.
that song. When I worked in a uh, nail salon a long time ago, they would always play, what is it, 94.9 Mix FM, and they would play Christmas music the whole month. So, oh, but yeah, I mean, in moderation, it's okay, but all day, every day, it's like, whoa. After a while, it's like, no thanks. Oh, how is she doing? I was living for it. When I was like, wow, Lena, you spoke it into existence that I was going to call you and tell you about that song. And then it Yeah. Usually all so long with the this time of year. How exciting for you. What's the walk and roll? No, what's that? No, oh, I don't eat buffets. The last time I ate at a buffet, I got super sick, so never again. Mm -hmm. Uh, China Olive. Nope. China Olive is on Urban Center. By the Buffalo Wild Wings. And that's when it was like super packed, too. And I got super ill. And never again. No more stickers. I mean, no more stickers. No more buffets for me. You heard it here first, folks. You said no more stickers. No, never, never, never. Can you pass me my sticker box? I want to use some of the squad ones. I think it'll look cool with this. Thank you. Let's see what it could be inside all this. All these knickknacks and trinkets and thingamabobs that I have in here. Which one? Yes, the one's called Word Up. This one's kind of cool too. Over 400, or oh, nearly 400 stickers, you guys. That's gonna be our new song. And can't stop, and won't stop. This is a good winter one too. I'm probably gonna do this one on Monday. No, there were French with the um, fantastic holiday, spectacular holiday on there. They were really pretty. Where are these bloody stickers? Many. Oh my gosh, it's hard for me to keep track. Look at that, you guys. What more can I do? Honey, all I want for Christmas is to be 150 pounds. Here they are. I found them. Stickers are called Squad. Yes, sir. Oh, where'd it go? Don't party too much, Ignacio. I already watched it. There's not a new episode until next week. The suspense. Mm 
girl having a panic attack. They're like, I need to know what's gonna happen. They're like, tell me now. How many episodes was it? Wow. E-boy? Wow. Yeah, that one was wild. Well, I know that HBO is shooting a show here. Oh, yeah, I saw that. It's about, like, cartels in the 70s or 80s. I'm not sure. It's so cute.
you got the five XL stiletto. She is ready for the fantasy. Let's put this one away. So on this one, I'm going to do velvet and shine. So these we're gonna do a nice thin coat of shiny. Very, very thin. So begin to encapsulate the stickers. This one I'm going to do velvet because I'm going to do kind of like a little bit of a design. Wait and see. So I hope you guys take advantage of the 
25% off sticker sale because I really feel that everybody should at least buy a sticker once just so you can find out how incredible and how changing they are to the game. And also don't forget the holiday acrylics. The Christmas silver, the Christmas white, these are so stunning, so, so stunning. Like they have so much glitter in them, it's not even funny. Beautiful. This is a Christmas silver, and they're available not only in a set but also a la carte. What do you think? That sparkle is no joke, right? Let's add a little bit of color from the cuticle oil because remember after the hand comes out of the lamp, we always wait 10 seconds before we apply cuticle oil. sticker it is melted into the nail. Ooh, I should do another color for the base because I cannot see anything. Gray on gray. Beautiful. I think that's going to be our money shot. Well my loves, I hope you guys enjoyed this little demo and I missed you guys. Don't forget that promo code CHARM25 and I'll see you guys in the next live video. Bye everybody.